Good day, everyone. Okay, uh, welcome to the ERP Next Series number seven. Uh, the topic that I'm gonna do in this video is uh, we have two topics. Uh, one is the bank account that that is like the accounting. You know, I mean, you can put your uh, bank account uh, for for deposit the money, and then another one is the item for the ERP Next. The item is the product, and in the latter lesson, you can do the sell and buy the item. Okay, let's enjoy. The video. Okay, hello everyone. Uh, let's go to the class number seven of the ERP next. You know, I mean, for this class, before we start, make sure that you download the text file. You know, I mean, the, the picture file that we have. Uh, the the link I have that that is in my Google Drive I have that you you can download uh, so we use this one in uh, the series number six okay and then we gonna uh, use this just for 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 today class okay so uh, let's begin I have so if you see inside the tech file I have they gonna have the the uh, information for for the customer you know I mean you you didn't need to keep typing you know you can just copy and paste and then we're gonna have the item and the bank account itself you see on of this uh, data I, I just make up so you didn't need to worry about that one okay so let's go to uh, uh, check uh, the my ERP next uh, is still running so I need to use the local host uh, to, to exit it uh, so once you go to the local host, uh, please make sure that you did not use uh, the the admin to do the work, right? I mean the admin should should use it for for create the user only. Uh, so we just have the normal user privileges. Uh, you do not use the admin, okay? So I use the uh, the the normal user, uh, and then uh, we go to the 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 menu, uh, the main menu, the Dex menu. Okay, so what we can what, what we gonna do is we want to have the bank account side, right? So you just uh, create the bank. Uh -huh. So we go to the bank list. In in this account, I did not have any bank at all. Uh -huh. So what I gonna do is I gonna uh, create the the bank account now. Mm. When you create the bank account, you you need not need to do anything. You just put the bank name, okay? So I put Bay, uh, the bank account. Okay. In when when you uh, contact with the bank, you can have some other uh, information if you want to. Okay. However, we just uh, go directly to the bank account. Bank account is mean the account that you deposit the money. You know. So for this tutorial class, I have. The number, right? so I have two account that is saving and then check account. Right? So normally when you run the business, you're gonna have both of them. Right? So you need to have the bank account name. That is the name that you gonna use in in the program. Right? So that is the, the account name, right? and then I have the uh, the 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 account number. Right? I put the number after the bank, and then you are gonna see the GL account. What is the GL account? GL is general ledger. So this one is mean the value of the account in the term of accounting. Right? So this one you you need not need to worry right? because most of the time when you create the company in in the uh, ERP next, they gonna have the GL for you already. Right? And then later on you can create your own one. Right? So in this one, uh, what I gonna do is mean I gonna have the uh, create the new uh, the 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 account. Right? Okay, here. Okay, so I, I just go to the uh, new bank account for for this. Uh, so you see, uh, I I have pay uh, I have pay the check already, right? So I do the saving because I want the the uh, the MSME to become the the check, right? Okay, so I go to pay and then put the name saving, right? And then uh, the parent account is the bank account. Hmm. This account type we can uh, make it to become bank or cash or another one, you know. But uh, we actually didn't need to set it right here, so we can just uh, leave this one bank, okay? And then you can click save the button. Uh -huh. 
Okay, so we we go back, nah, and then in in the bank in here, nah. So what we gonna do is we gonna put the bank, ah, uh, the the bank name, nah, and then in this account type again here, what you can do is you can ah uh, trying to create the new type of the account, you know, and then the other information as well, nah. So at this moment, we don't want to do saving, right? So we just just make the name like saving. นะครับเอ่อ don't worry this one is will not affect another part นะครับ so you leave the default and company account because most of the time we gonna use check นะครับ so we just save นะฮะ so after we save we go back to the uh, bank account we gonna see in here right so we create another one that is check นะครับ this one is gonna be our default so I go to use the same bank base right and then put the Uh, account number after after this one, นะครับ Okay, so after it, I check it to become default and then company account, นะครับ And then the GL register we uh GL account we use the the one, นะครับ The the one that create from the company. The bank is still bay anyway. And then this account type, I create account type to become, uh become become the check account. Uh, okay, and the another information you can put, uh, but at this moment I can just 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 finish, uh, just skip. Okay, so what your guy can see here is mean we have two bank account, uh, and then that is for the bank account stuff. Uh, okay, so we can continue to another part that is the item uh, from. Here. Okay, uh, we gonna go to the item. Uh, we gonna cre cre create uh, the uh, item uh, for for use it in the ERP next. Uh, so we go to the account uh, and then you click the master uh, uh, the item. You know. However, uh, we uh, gonna make the new item that is the product. You know, they are allowed to put the item code, but. We need to do item group, you know. I mean, you you see, uh, we we gonna sell toy like even though, but the, we we didn't have the toy yet. Like we we have the some consumer or some product. So I go to the menu item group. นะครับ item group is in the form of tree. นะครับ tree is mean something like the folder, you know. So we have uh, a lot of stuff, but I I I don't want to use uh, one of them. นะครับ so you know what I gonna do is I I gonna create the new New group, นะครับ So I say toy, นะครับ T O Y toy, นะครับ Something like that, นะครับ And uh, the toy is the group node because we gonna have the subgroup, นะครับ Okay, so I create a new one, and then you see we gonna have the folder, นะครับ Okay, and then we can add shy to become the Lego. So it means the item gonna belong to Lego, นะครับ Belong to Lego, right? So so we will not have the item toy, นะครับ So we have the Lego, but I found out that mm, maybe I want to to นะครับ uh, the the uh, the toy like this one, นะครับ I I want to put the S, นะครับ I want to change it so I can click rename. นะครับ and then I I save save the name นะครับ after you save it when you go back uh, to the item group you need to refresh the screen นะครับ to to make it to become the uh, the the toy you want นะฮะ something like that นะครับ okay so I keep refreshing maybe uh, I need to uh, create a new window นะครับ maybe it's better idea okay. So once we have item group, the next thing is the the item itself. Okay, so I go to the the uh, the main menu, the decks, and then I uh, choose the accounts. นะครับ So this time we go to the item, uh, and then we are ready because we have item group already. นะฮะ So what we gonna do here is we create a new item. นะฮะ Okay, so let's see. We do the item code. You know, I mean, we gonna sell the toy and then uh, the our toy is Lego, right? The Lego have the code inside. So when we when we do actually when we sell, we use the the code like the barcode or if you do something, it can be UPC. นะครับ So I put the Lego and then the code. Yeah, you see the code of the Lego itself. นะครับ the the Lego they they have code right. So the, I use it as the item code. You know, and then the item name is the the name. นะครับ so you can go to the text file. นะครับ Lego Technic. นะค่ะ right the transporter. And then the item group is Lego. Yeah, we did it already. So we gonna have it. And then the measurement is gonna be box. นะครับ 
โอเค and then we do the maintain this stock นะครับ however sometimes you may have opening stock because when you implement the ERP sometimes you 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 continue from another one program you know I mean you you did not just use the brand new company right so we can put the opening stock balance right so it means we have the stock already in 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 our in in your company right but anyway uh, this one we just assume that we just start the new business นะครับ even the selling rate we can do you know I mean the the uh, standard selling rate นะครับ but we just leave it blank for here and then I save after uh, we 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 save นะครับ what you gonna see is they gonna have uh, the item นะครับ in 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 your you are the ERP next นะครับ so you click one more time because you cannot put put the picture right away right so you click on the on the abbreviation and then you can drop the picture นะครับ so you go to the folder นะครับ and then use the picture make sure that you use the same uh, picture code right and then I click upload so that's it you see they gonna have their their uh, picture นะครับ of this product come นะครับ and then you can have another information but we didn't need to uh, worry about this one because this kind of the record will not come when we do the transaction so I save and then that's it uh, that's that's that finish for one of the one 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 of the the uh, the item that that I have already นะครับโอเค so this one is the car transporter when you come back you gonna see it so I create so another two of them is gonna be the piece of cake นะครับ so I do another Lego นะครับ I put it นะครับ and then the name right the Lego Technic Bugatti Chiron okay so I do the Bugatti Chiron and then the group is still Lego right and then the measurement is gonna be box นะครับ and okay and I just leave another option นะครับ you can click edit in the full page right so you you uh, you what you can do is you can just put on of the record but anyway you need to 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 save it นะครับ so so that you can come back uh, you see and then you can put the picture นะครับ so anyway you need to save one time before you can put the picture that that is the system นะครับ so I put the Chiron uh Bugatti Chiron here and then that's it นะครับ okay and that's we have two items uh, so we go to uh, the last one uh, okay, so the uh, the Lego this one is gonna be the heavy duty forklift uh, for for uh, the Lego technique. Okay, so we put it, and then the item group is the Lego as you sure, and the uh, unit of measurement gonna be box. Nakap anyway. Nakap okay, and then I save it, and yeah, and the item gonna gonna come, and what we gonna do is we gonna put the picture on on the item uh -huh. okay here we are uh -huh. so heavy duty forklift uh -huh. and then we put the uh, picture uh -huh. the uh, deco box and just upload and that's it uh -huh. so yes we gonna have three of them uh -huh. and then yes that is uh, we we ready to to use this one for sale and buy uh -huh. however if you are trying to use this one, we gonna know that the item is not 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 just the master data you need to put. Uh -huh. In the next tutorial, we gonna put another the item like like the term and condition, uh -huh. something like that. Okay, so I think this uh, tutorial is come long enough, right? So I think I gonna finish here. Okay, thank you for uh, seeing my my tutorial and see you again in the next video. Bye bye.